Hey Google, what's the weather like right now? Right now in Dallas, it's 55 degrees and sunny. It actually feels so much warmer than that. You know what that means. Okay, so um, it is cold. I feel the 55 degrees. I hate running in the cold. But you know what? Ya estoy aquí. I personally hate it. This is other people's perfect weather to go run in. I guess I'll run in your ideal weather. I'm acting like if this is being forced upon me, but it's not. I'm going by myself and I, it, I can go out and walk three steps and get back in my car if I don't feel like running. So we're good. Nomás vamos a ver qué fix. Remember how beautiful this was when everything was green? Okay, there's actually quite a bit of people running right now. Is this like the ideal weather? No, right? No, because when it is warmer, it does get more packed. I need it to be 90 degrees already. <laughs> Cansado. If it was hot, I would be drenched right now, which is why I miss the heat. Tanto esfuerzo para casi nada de resultado. Are you kidding me? Okay, I got los cuatro millas. Ni les voy a decir cuánto tarde en las cuatro millas because honestly, I was I kept stopping, stopping to take pictures. It's just like these guys over here are doing. Yes, get those Instagram pictures because yes, it looks all dead, but it does look pretty somehow okay bye see four miles ran and i look like i just went a caminar where's the sweat where's the sweat but it's okay because i've been a spring every day like i kid you not every single day i look at that weather app and i see at what time sunset's gonna be that day and every day it's a minute later and I love it, love it. Me emociona every single time that I see it and it's a minute later than it was the day before. I've been over the cold since before it even got cold. I've been over the cold since, since I knew winter was coming. In freaking like October, when it was still pretty, it was still pretty warm outside, but I knew like the winter was coming. I was so over it already. And now I'm even more over it.
don't know why, but I'm showering without music today. I have my mind at peace right now. I'm in a peaceful mind kind of mood right now. It might not last not even like an hour, but well, that's where we're at right now. Back to this hole that had a lot of things to say the other day, might be was good. I know I shouldn't use cotonetes, but they're so easy to use because I've been doing this my whole life. And yes, maybe I have um, my left oreja tapada a little more than usual, but it's fine. Voy a poder escuchar. Looks good. Okay, that first thrift store, yeah, it's cute as hell and I love it. Okay, I knew they closed at 5.30, but I have no idea, like, they low-key closed at 5. But, like, at 5.10, they were like, okay, we're closing in 10 minutes, everybody go to the register. I'm like, girl, it's 5.10. But you know what? I don't, I, I don't know. I don't work retail. Um, I just felt pressured. Uh, but I did buy three things. I see toda apurada. Hopefully, I like the three things because ain't no returning them. I only like two items, which is good. Porque no tengo dinero. Honestly, the way this looks just like my current outfit, but like the dark version. You pick me on Smash Bros and then you just change the color, and it's this. Could I get the box combo, but instead of the slaw, could I get another sauce? What's a drink? A large lemonade. Large lemonade, off? That'll be all. Mm. Yes, I'm watching the Hunchback of. Honestly, I don't know how to say that school or that city. North, North, Notre Dame. Notre Dame. The Hunchback of Notre Dame. Notre Dame. I don't know how to say it, but I'm watching, yes, I'm watching The Hunchback. That was a long intro. Are my intros that long? No. I was summoned from the wars to capture fortune tellers and palm readers. Uh, the real war captain is what you see before you. For 20 Bro. years, I have been taking care. Well, that was a good meal. One by one. It's not my fault. I've got to blame. It is the gypsy girl, the witch, who set this flame. It's not my fault. If in God's plan. The devil's so much stronger than a man. 
Wow, so I never understood this movie before. So the guy's like horny for Esmeralda, like the evil old guy. And he's like, well, if I can't have her, she won't be with me, then she'll die. Crazy. I have no idea the movie was like this. Why is this movie like so much better than I remember it? I'm like, why is this my new favorite movie of all time? <laughs> okay, Google. What time is it? It's 8.28 p.m. No way, I'm ready to go to bed. And it's pretty nice. So let's see if I like what I got from the thrift. Bueno, pues you already know I did like the shirt and the jeans. So that's a yes. Then I bought two sweaters and a shirt from the other place that I was being rushed at. So capaz si no me guste. J.P. Hogan, Coring and Sign Corporation, AAA J.P. Hogan. ¿Por qué compré este suéter? No sé. Oh, I like it. Oh, I like it. ¿Qué es J.P. Hogan? No sé, ni quiero saber. Honestly, yeah, I like this flag. Se me hace que por eso la compré. The rest can suck it. It's the fit is great. Love it, love it, love it, love it. Okay, this other also hoodie I bought is kind of small. So, a ver qué pex con esa. Si, sí, ni me cabe la cabeza. Oops. Oh. Okay, it's cute. It's not as thick, so this one I can wear when it's not that cold outside. Like, this is fine, Mount Rushmore, never been, will I ever go, not in my bucket list, but quien sabe, never say never. Um, but I like this. It also says Mount Rushmore, but I like that it was on the sleeve. That looked really cool. This actually also fits really good. Just, it's just a different fit. It just fits smaller. Honestly, love. Love. Parece suéter, pero no es un suéter. Si es una camisa de manga larga. Just a little formal. Okay, love. And actually, I also got it because Nautica, the way I used to be obsessed with Nautica a couple years ago. Okay, these purchases going off. No, yes, love. Love, love, love. And then these are the jeans. I did get them. Great, great purchases. Thank you, God, for not letting me fail. Nunca se acaba la ropa sucia. But maybe that's more a blessing than a curse. Okay, so you guys know how I'm building a gallery wall. How I've been building one for three years now. Um, well, I'm still not gonna build it, right? I made an album of pictures that I've taken that I've liked, and then I added them to this album of printable pictures. And yeah, so I just made this album. Yeah, pictures that I've taken that I would like to get printed. Um, some of them are of people, it's actually my background. Some of them are just pictures that I think look good. See, like, that would be cute, right? To put in the gallery wall that's non-existent. Right? So I'm not making that gallery wall yet, but I do have these two picture frames that I can put, um, in this corner over here. And what if I just start with these two pictures? They're like 39 cents each. And apparently Walgreens prints 24 seven. So I could literally go right now. So I'm thinking of getting this picture. I think it's a really, really good picture. I took this of El Sobrino Mar, El Sobrino Gerardo. I took this picture when we went walking in El Rio over there in Guatimape, over there in Mexico. Oh my God, whenever Mexico, whenever it rains, 
y se llena el río y se pone todo verde. It's so pretty. Such a vibe. And then like, look, las montañas allá atrás. La presa llena. And then I took, uh, I took this picture when we had, we crossed the river y nos, pues nos quitamos los zapatos para poder cruzar. And then we were putting them back on. Look, this is that same day. This is Gerardo. Look. People just swimming here. Ahí se ven las tres cabezas, la tienda de acampar, el caballo, la camioneta, las montañas. Such a vibe, man. I miss Mexico. Okay, yeah, but I'm thinking of printing this one for one of them. And then this one for the other one. This is my dad. This is my dad. Look at the moon. También fue en México. We went to this, we went to this little town like 15 minutes away from our little town. Y luego, whenever we went, we were there, we had fun, we hiked a little. We hiked a lot, actually. We hiked, we ate. And then when we were going back to regresarnos a nuestro rancho, se quebró la camioneta. Like, no, sa no sé qué le pasó a la camioneta, no sé cómo se quebró, pero se quebró. It was, like, very bumpy to get there, because, you know, all these Mexican roads, están todas, parece freaking, you have to go through the Grand Canyon. Para llegar de pueblo en pueblo. And anyway, se le quebró una pieza de abajo de la camioneta. Ahí estaban these guys. And then whenever we called my dad, they understood what was wrong with it. And they were like, no, tráigase, tráigase su máquina de soldar. Because my dad's a welder. Tráigase su máquina de soldar. Se le quebró un fierro, se le quebró una pieza de ahí abajo. Quién sabe qué. Y then that's what my dad did. He came from El Rancho, he came, he found us, he brought his, like, portable máquina de soldar. Para aprender su máquina, no sé, tenía que robarse la luz, o se robó la luz de este poste. And here he is, like, accessing it. Y luego, we were just watching him fix it, y se hizo una bola de gente, and everybody from, like, the town was just watching him fix it. I don't know, I'm so bad at storytelling. Pero, like, se juntaron todos... Todos los señores estaban viendo cómo arreglaba. Todos vimos cómo se subió de aquí hasta allá. Antes cuando mi papá era más ágil. Ya no sé si puede hacer esto. Se subió de aquí hasta allá. Se robó la luz, se bajó, la soldó, la arregló. It was like a whole ass story. Like, wow, 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 wow. ¿Yo cuándo podría hacer eso? Never. Pero tomé la foto cuando se robó la luz. Y cuando dio chispas. Las chispas... I guess, I don't know, my, I sent this picture to my dad because he's really proud of it too. He's like, esas chispas, he's like, wow, salió bien bonita esta foto. Las chispas nomás fueron como un segundo y, y se captura en la foto. And I'm like, yeah, yeah, and it is a really good picture. And it's a whole ass story. Okay, whatever. I'm thinking of <laughs> getting sidetracked. Uh, okay, I'm thinking of these two. Getting these two printed. Thank you for your order. We'll enter this confirmation to you. You may also save your print this page. It was 82 cents. It says it should be estimated time. It should be ready in 30 minutes. Okay, this is the corner I'm talking about. Something like that. Might as well use the 30 minutes while the pictures are printing to make the holes. If I was taller. I was shorter. Oh yeah, like that look. Okay. Maybe I'm really just eyeballing you guys. Okay. Like right there. I'm just using these tornillos. I don't even know if this is what I'm supposed to use.
it's done. I guess that's the location, yeah. Lo que Dios hizo que no lo separe el hombre. Okay, it's freaking 11.25. I just got the email. They're ready. Andrade, A N D, A -N -D. yeah. So I realized uh, you can see the the cardboard in the back because the picture's not big enough. So I'm gonna use freaking bank statements. Don't look at that to put in the back because I do not have any white paper here. Don't look at it. Oh my God! Do not look at my bank statement. This is very sensitive information. Looks good. Okay, good night.